First, I would just give some words about the FIDAP panel. What is this panel? What is, what is it doing? And in fact, this panel is uh, providing scientific uh, advices uh, for safety and efficacy of uh, feed additives, feed products and feed substances. And in fact, it is composed by about 21 experts which cover uh, different scientific areas, the animal nutrition, the toxicology, the microbiology, the environmental exposure. Uh, and finally, in the last five years, we produced uh, 400 opinions, what means about 80 opinions a, a year. So it's a very huge workload. And in fact, uh, today we had a specific uh, topic uh, to, to discuss about the maximum levels of copper in feed. And in fact, uh, we have uh, the, the chair of this working group, which is Professor Jürgen Grop, and he will give you some indication on the discussion uh, today. Here we are, we, we got a, a mandate from the European Commission to revise the maximum content of copper in, in animal feed. And there is a, a, a setting of this maximum contents, and we checked that under the aspect to, let's say, to reduce it to the levels which are necessary from a nutritional point of view because this was not the case in our in our view and for this we did a huge data collection from member states and from from stakeholders and by procurements to have a safe basis for the requirement for allowances for potential deficiencies and what is the tolerance of animals and this all had to be nicely calibrated to find new values which are high enough to ensure that animal safety, welfare and productivity is guaranteed further on with these new levels and no negative aspects would appear on consumer safety and we have a certain advantage also on the environment, the reduction in the copper emission from mainly from, from piglet husbandry uh, can be expected. And this opinion is now adopted by the panel. Thank you, Kido. Considerable reduction in case of piglets from 170 to 25 milligram per kilo feet. And for cattle and dairy cows, we reduced it from we propose the reduction from 35 to 30 milligram fraction. In fact, we 24 observers were registered, and maybe a little bit less than 20 were, were there. And in fact, they, they were there for the whole time, of course, and they were really interested. They, they took some notes. So. And, uh, and also they, they made some questions before the meeting and we had the opportunity at the very end of the meeting to, to give some answer to, to the question and also to, to give them the opportunity to, to, to ask other questions. So my impression is that it was really useful for, for them but also for the plenary to see that uh, finally uh, about 20 people were there from the industry, from the from the consultancy, from the, in the industry association. So finally, it was a, a useful afternoon.